it's Akila, and this is episode five of my Sims 4 Growing Together series. It's Friday night currently, and I'm not feeling too good. I can barely keep my food down. I just had some strawberries, and even those made me sick. But as you guys know, Kaden and I have been trying for baby number two, so this could absolutely be a sign of pregnancy. Now, I'm a little nervous to take the test, so I'm just gonna go ahead and sit down. We're gonna have, oh my lord, we're gonna have Kaden come and make some dinner for himself and Arya. I'm gonna skip out tonight. So let's see what we can have. Ooh, sausage rolls sound good. Something basic that I feel like he would make. So let's just go ahead and do that. And we have little Miss Arya on her little tablet. Teddy is chilling, watching the TV, which he really loves to do in real life. You know what? Why don't we go ahead and give him some affection? Cause he's always, he's always asking for some. He's always just like wanting to be loved on. So let's do that. You know, I'm just trying to clear my mind. I'm gonna take the pregnancy test first thing in the morning. I feel like that's the best thing to do. And here he goes making dinner. Arya is very exhausted right now, but I, I don't wanna even make her upset and take the tablet away. So we're gonna just let her chill. You know what? While dinner's in the oven, let's not take her iPad away, but let's just have her come over here go to potty by herself because she's a big girl and we could have a little baby on the way. I just want to make sure that she has the fundamentals down. We're still going to try to give her as much love and affection as we can if we have baby number two. But you know, I also just want to make sure she can be somewhat self-efficient. That's really important. Um. So yeah, she's, she's so tired. I'm going to actually cheat this just a little bit. Um, cause I don't want her to have a full on meltdown. Why did he put the food on the floor? You asked this man to do one thing and okay. Anyways, call to meal and eat. Just, just Aria. I'm not going to have anything. Matter of fact, I'm going to go upstairs and start getting ready for bed. So let me just go and brush my teeth. I'll do a little bit of cleaning. Yeah, it's about to be 8 o'clock p.m. Maybe I'll have a cup of water. You know, nothing wrong with that. I'll have a cup of water. We're gonna feed. Actually, we'll have Kaden do it. She is doing so well. Like, she, she is getting those skills up. I'm gonna give her some privacy. All right, I'm getting my water. She's very sad, but I am going to put myself to bed. Yes, um, I'm going to just go ahead and sleep. And Kaden can put Arya to bed once she's done eating. Did she grab her food yet? No, she she did not grab her food. There we go. Grab a serving specifically for her. And Teddy, what are you about to go do? Sit nearby. How about you go to bed as well? They can have some daddy-daughter time. What is going on in here? Mop that up. Oh, that is just nasty. But she's about to eat her food like a good girl. She loves eating up on this little couch right here. And look who's nearby, ready to pick up the scraps. Teddy, of course. I don't know if I showed y'all this in the last episode, but Kaden and Arya drew SpongeBob and Patrick. It is so adorable. But yeah, we're gonna have Kaden go ahead and put her to sleep. Look at her making a mess. Of course. Teddy, what is he about to do? He's getting comfortable. Okay, she, she's really just playing around in the food at this point. So honestly, yeah, go ahead and put her to bed. He's gonna read her to sleep because I don't think they've actually done that together before. So let's speed that up a little because it's late. I wonder what book they're gonna read. It shouldn't take long for her to knock out. Like, she's, she's gonna be asleep. So cute. And then afterwards, he can go ahead and brush his teeth. I hope she doesn't wake up at the crack of dawn because it's 11 p.m. Tomorrow is Saturday. If I'm pregnant, I want to wake Kaden up to the good news. That's why I put myself to bed before him. Look, he's tired too. Everyone is just tired today. It's been a long week, but we finally made it to the weekend. Is my mother here? 
How? Mom, why are you here in the middle of the night? See, well, if she's going to be here, she could actually um empty the trash because this is a mess. I really don't know what to do about this potty. Like, how am I supposed to? Can I just reset it? Okay, there we go. Perfect. It's spick and span. And she could put the food away. And then after that, um, she can go. Because that is so random. Like, why are you here at midnight, basically? Let's just speed this interaction up. Okay, and now I'm going to remove her from family. She's leaving. She's leaving on her own. Okay, so we sped through the night. It is now 4 a.m. and I'm rushing to the restroom. Uh-oh. First of all, let me just go ahead and make this clean. Brush her teeth. And we're thinking about it. We're like, dang, this... This must be it. I have to be pregnant. Let's run it up. Wait, wait. It's okay. Let's take it. Oh my goodness. I'm taking the test. I'm taking the test. I just peed on it. By the way, I'm looking at this test. There's no way I'm not pregnant. But let's wait for the confirmation though. Let's wait, let's wait. Come on, give me the news. I knew it. Eating for two. OMG, wait, Kaden just woke up. <gasps> ah, baby bump! Jeez! I just. Hold on! Already? Okay, okay. Let's tell my man. I'm pregnant! You make my day so much better. Thanks for making me smile. OMG. But I'm not doing well. This morning sickness is crazy. Let's have him kiss cheek. Uh, ooh, give massage. Yes. Yes, please. Woohooing in the treehouse is crazy. Like, that's just nasty. Belly hug. Oh my goodness. Guys, I'm eating for two. Schwabe. Ooh. Okay. Wait! Hello? That is the absolute cutest! Look at us! We are gonna have a little baby boy in this room! Soon! You know what? I'm so excited. Our house is gonna definitely be hectic, but it's gonna be so great. What? But wait, hold on. I didn't forget what happened to my massage. No, I wanted a massage. Share pregnancy news. Didn't we already do that? I'm confused. I guess the belly hug is just gonna have to be enough. Ooh, I am surprised that Arya is still asleep though, which is which is really good. I do need to change my outfit. Isn't this the cutest background ever? Like it looks like we're already in Baby Boy's nursery. But, um, oh yeah, by the way, did I mention that I'm like cheating that? I think I did, but in case you missed it, I'm cheating it. We're having a boy, without a doubt. So, um, let me see. Maybe this. Ooh, I am going to put this on. I like the color, so I'm gonna keep it. The slippers are cool. We could keep wearing the bunny slippers. That's fine. I just wanted something a little more covered up now. Okay, cool. Well, um... You know, I feel decent right now. I can make some breakfast for us. I don't mind. I'm kind of craving honey banana toast. So let's do that. Gotta listen to those those pregnancy cravings. And Caden, where's Teddy at? Oh, I see him. Um, honestly, what can we do? What can we do? Maybe, oh, wait, there, there's a couple things I can do with the, with Panda Sama's childbirth mod. We'll do it after I have breakfast, though. Um, but we should probably go and see the doctor today, the one who helped us deliver Aria. So yeah, we should make an appointment. Hopefully they can squeeze us in. There's breakfast. That looks oh, absolutely yeah. delicious. Um, Teddy! <laughs> Oh my goodness. Is there a way we can tell her that I'm having a baby? I'm gonna eat my breakfast. Actually, yeah, let me just eat mine. Let me grab a serving and Teddy can come and eat because he, this boy clearly needs something to do. Wait a minute, when? 
Since when? She can go down these stairs by herself? That's crazy. Honestly, Kaden can have this serving. I'll grab another one. What is about to happen here? Oh. What the heck? Teddy crapped on the floor? Oh my goodness. Uh-uh. After, he needs to go throw that away. Why did he do that? Anyways. We're gonna snuggle Arya. Just to let her know that no matter what, we're still gonna love her. We're always gonna have time for you. Okay, now we can eat. So let me grab a serving for her. I'll have my serving afterwards. So many leftovers that we just need to eat in the fridge. So we'll try to do that. Um, especially since I'm pregnant and you know. Like, I don't feel like cooking all the time. I know Caden can, but it'll just be easier if we finish eating the stuff we had for the longest. We're gonna call the obstetrician so we can make our birth arrangements. All right, y'all. Caden got Teddy's poop. I'm, I'm so mad at him. Why did he do that? Honestly, he... Let's just scratch favorite spot. It's really... It's so repetitive with him. They can go for a go for a jog. You know what? Why not? It's early. It's Saturday. Why not? I'm gonna handle my business over here. I think I'm gonna do that right now. Yes. Okay, birthing options. Choosing the right birth method for you and your baby can be a daunting task. There are so many different options. It can be easy to get lost in the medical jargon and confused by the countless delivery practices. Which method are you considering? Okay, there's a surgery machine. I don't know about that. Um, um yeah, no. Mm -mm. Natural delivery, a C-section, home birth, get an ultrasound. We do need an ultrasound. So that's what we're going to do today. Um, I'm going to have to do this twice. So honestly, let's just do the ultrasound first. Doesn't that make sense? And then we'll talk everything else. But I'm, I kind of, I don't know, like an at-home water birth could be nice, but I feel like that's a little scary, honestly. You might just have to do natural delivery. Oh, okay, okay, get an ultrasound. A pregnancy ultrasound appointment is a routine medical exam that is performed during the pregnancy to assess the health and development of the fetus, um, blah, blah, blah. Uh, the appointment usually takes 30 minutes to an hour, first trimester, and then again in the second trimester. Let's go. We just arrived at our ultrasound appointment and Kaden wanted to, of course, take a picture, so let's go ahead and do that. And like I mentioned, we're here with Dr. Grace, who helped us deliver Aria. So we, of course, 100% trust her with our second pregnancy. Fingers crossed everything goes well and is normal so far with the ultrasound. But I think you can tell by my face I'm kind of nervous. Of course, I want to be hopeful, but you never know. Ah, Rafa. The reassurance from Rafa. our doctor Rafa. definitely Rafa. helps. And we have Kaden here, who is obviously getting a little emotional over there. Oh my goodness, look, there's our little boy. He's so small. Well, you guys can look at the ultrasound and I'm gonna go ahead and read the pop-up we just got. So it said, congratulations, you're pregnant. Well, we could definitely tell. <laughs> Based on the ultrasound scan, it looks like you're expecting one healthy baby. Everything looks good so far, but we'll continue to monitor your pregnancy and the baby's development to make sure everything stays on track. This is an exciting time and we're here to support you every step of the way. The ultrasound scan shows that you're expecting a healthy baby boy. But there he is. Wow, I can't imagine how this feels in real life. Like, I am definitely not ready. This is so cool. Make sure you ask for the picture, girl. We need to take it home so I can show my mom. Okay, she just said show, make sure she gets that for us. Well, that wasn't so bad. Okay, great first scan. Well, I guess I can go ahead and put my clothes back on, of course. Sims is crazy, because why is my stomach this big already? Like, 
What are we doing? Well, we're gonna go ahead and just bask in the moment for now and just talk about everything. And I'll see you guys when we get back home so I can break the news to my mom. I hope she's excited. Okay, I had to take a picture. That is too cute. Okay, so now everyone is back home and I just have to use the restroom, of course. We're gonna have Kaden call my mom over. There we go. And I also need to confirm my choices uh, for my birthing option. So we're gonna do natural delivery for now, but comment if you guys would wanna see an at-home birth where we um, do like a water birth. We could do a water birth at the hospital, but this is just what I'm gonna pick for now. Natural delivery is a low-tech way of giving birth by letting nature take its course. You may travel to the hospital, blah, blah, blah. Um, and this stage lasts about 70 minutes. Once your baby is born, they will be handed to you immediately for skin-to-skin -skin contact. So that's what we're gonna go with. But of course, I can change it if I want to. My mom is gonna be over, so of course we can Tell her the news, because that's really important. Let's have little Miss Aria come over here. She can take a nap, honestly. My mom's here! Okay, um, let's add her to family. Let's go ahead and share pregnancy news. All right, here we go. Surprise! Mom, you are going to have a second grandchild, and it's a boy! And here's the ultrasound picture to prove it. She's like, again? Look at that. She hasn't hugged me like this in a minute. <laughs> Our family is about to get a little bigger. Aria is going to be a big sister. Well, I think this is the perfect spot to go ahead and end this video. But comment down below and let me know if you're excited for baby number two. Maybe even leave some name suggestions. And with that being said, I'll see you guys next time. Bye! But I